Are you listening? Damn. Uh. Yeah. Welcome to the Real Real Pop. My name is David, and I'm here with my co host, Amada Hi! <laughs> here in the Real and Real, we take a concept of character from a movie and ask the question, what if it or they were in the real world? Do you have to see the movie to. No. Okay, I didn't even finish my question. <laughs> you just, people are like, what, what, what was it? What, what was it? No, just well, if no. You, if you've been on the. Maybe they are new, okay? Oh. Do you have to see the movie Fine. to understand the episode or enjoy it? No. There you go, people. Okay. <laughs> so, Marcy, tell us what today's question is. Today's question is, what if everyone had accelerated healing powers based off of the movie Deadpool? There's this kid. He's in trouble. I ain't letting Cable get to him. But I can't do this alone. We need backup. We're going to form a super duper group. So are you interested in seeing, uh, well, first, did you see the first Deadpool? Yes. Did you like the first Deadpool? Yes. Are you interested in seeing the second Deadpool? Yes. Oh, okay. You? I am absolutely interested in Deadpool. Okay. <laughs> Specifically because Zazie Beats is in it. Wow. She is gorgeous. <laughs> ah, so You're gorgeous. You're like, specifically because of Zazie Beats. Gorgeous. I don't have celebrity crushes like that. That one was amazing. That one was just, ugh. Anyway. Anyway. So, so yeah. yes. Her, uh... And I'm interested in also the, oh, the, I think the last trailer I saw was that they were like, what's your superpower? He said, courage. And he was like, that's cute. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> I honestly love all of the trailers for Deadpool. Deadpool's trailers are one of the best. Yes. I don't know if this one will be as good as the first one. Probably not. Because it looks more like a traditional superhero film. Yeah, kind of Still a bunch is. of jokes. The other one had one, technically one big fight scene, two, and they just stretched the one middle fight scene out over a Chunks. lot. Yeah, a lot. Because they didn't have a budget. This one, they have the same budget or about around a little bit more. Still, yeah. So, um, I'm interested to see what's going to happen. But anyway... So, we will give, give you guys our three points. Wait. So, those who do not oh. know about Deadpool have never seen Deadpool and were dumb and took their kids to Deadpool and oh, didn't realize yeah. that they had a bunch of... Because they saw don't Marvel. But anyway, for those who don't know, Deadpool has regen regenerative powers where you can he can break an arm and it'll just... You know, fix itself, or he can get his hand shut he off, has a and baby it'll, hand. it'll grow back after it gets cut off or something. It takes about a day, but it comes back. Comes back, okay. But yeah, so anyway, that's why the question is what the question is, and we'll tell you our three points if everyone could had regenerative, re had regenerative powers. powers. It's really hard to say. After the break, accelerated healing. There we go. Is that what I said? Didn't I write that down? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Accelerated healing. <laughs> Accelerate. We wrote down the easy and decided to go with the hard. Yep, pretty much. Hey guys, it's me, David. First off, I want to say thanks for listening. Whether you're on iTunes, Google, SoundCloud, Podcast Addict, or anywhere else, we really appreciate it. If you'd like to support the show, we do have a Patreon where you can give one dollar a month. You get a few extra audio treats, and it helps the show keep going. If you're a company who likes us to advertise your product, or you're just a fan that wants to say hello, you can contact the show directly via email reelandrealpod at gmail.com we also have a twitter at reelandrealpod that's r-e-e-l-i-n r-e-a-l p-o-d thanks for listening you're the best and enjoy the rest of the show and we're back marcy hey. the question was what if everyone had accelerated healing what are your three points my first point of my three points is that there are no more doctors Darn it, that's good. <laughs> did you not think of that? I did. I said no more hospitals. That is my okay. first point. So we'll just go into your doctors and I'll just pee back off that. Continue. I mean, it kind of works because there's no need for them. Like, Unless you're into those doctors, uh, medicine men maybe just for... Medicine men? Oh no, what would you need them for? You mean a healer, like a, a natural, a holistic healer? Yeah, but you're not being The healed. only reason oh, that oh, I could see... Oh, oh psychiatrist. Was, yes, those are the only doctors. Psychiatrists, psychiatrists and psychologists. The, yes, the, yes. Those are the only ones because you, you can don't have need... accelerated healing but still be kind of loopy. Yes. So, crazy. Yes. Or just dealing with personal things. Or might yeah. have lost somebody. Might have had stress at work. Might yep. be. Oh wait, how did you lose somebody? Depression. Never mind. I apologize. You didn't lose anybody. Um, well, maybe actually you could. They could. Someone could. Yeah, kill someone them. could lose somebody, You'd and have then to it spirals them, them into in the, depression. No, I meant in this world. Oh, don't you have to you know. decapitate them? I don't know. I think decapitation would be the way to go. Because honestly, they don't kind of, they really don't mention that in Deadpool on how he dies. So I kind of likened his 
healing abilities somewhat to Wolverines into the I fact assume it's that, the same type. Yeah, like into the fact that the only way that he could die is if you decapitated him. No, you can drown him. Oh yeah, that too. But yeah. I that's thought a, that's a one. I figured decapitation would be a lot easier than drowning <laughs> Wolverine. Except mm, no, for, not no, Wolverine is heavy. Yes. <laughs> that's, yes, wait a minute. Wolverine's it's not hard at all. There have been many iterations where he's scared to get in the water. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so not Wolverine. Yeah, because you can just throw him in the water. Just, <laughs> well, the, the thing was, yeah, he all you got to do is put like cement blocks in their feet and then just chunk them in the water. Simple as that. Yeah. yeah. I assume it's easier than running out and trying to chunk <laughs> 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 Everybody has katanas. Just swinging at their ching, heads. Ching, 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 yeah. ching. I figure you just hit them when they're asleep or something and just like carry them to the water. <laughs> so you got to do something with that head. Like, no, it's uh, too much. No, I don't want to deal with that. Ew, no. Then. But anyway, um, yeah, so I guess psychiatrist and what was the other one? Psychologist. Uh-huh. Which one? One is a group of people, right? And one is just the individual person. Psychology is a study of the mind. Psychiatrist is the practitioner. There you go. I can't think of any other doctors. I'm sure there are a bunch of them. That's really all I can think of. The only other one is holistic medicine is to try and make you heal faster than what you already heal. Yeah, you wouldn't need that. Unless you just really... Well, no, because Deadpool can feel pain. So. Okay. Maybe these are holistic or pain management. Oh, you're smart. Those people. Pain management or holistic, whole managed pain people, whatever. I don't know words. Them. Uh, mine was that uh, no there would be hospitals. no more hospitals, which is sad because then there'd be no more nurses. No, no, no. I am wrong. There would still be hospitals. Yeah, there would. Babies. Yeah. Babies need to be born. Yeah, there would. There'd just be baby hospitals. Yeah. Oh, then that negates my point too, because there would be still be doctors because you'd need baby doctors for what? To make sure your baby's good. Your baby heals itself. As in, your pre- You need the the. Obgyn person, the obstetrician gynecologist. I don't know the the baby doctor. Gynecologist <laughs> <laughs> obstetrician. You need the baby doctor so gotcha. that like when they're doing the ultrasounds and all that, they're like, oh yeah, your baby's good. He's not gonna like. Nah. But does it matter? Yeah, because in the womb they can them? like choke them. They can be choked with their umbilical cords. They so. just heal themselves. They're choked to death. That's like drowning. You suffocate the child with its own cord. So they got to be in there to be like, all right, okay, so you need to go in there and flip this and turn it, and there you go. Yeah, but would you need some? Okay, I guess so. And then also, if they come out breached, they can get stuck, and that's again suffocation. Okay, so you just need someone to deliver them. You but need baby that, doctors. You don't need that many <laughs> doctors, though. No. Because it's just a couple of them to deal with. Not a couple, but a lot of people having babies. But I'm just so saying. So maybe like. You don't need anybody around the clock. 10 per state. Yeah. Because once they're born, that's it. Yeah. I'm done. That's really it. Your baby's going to be okay. You literally don't have to worry about your kid getting hurt or anything. Yeah. Just, it's just run like, around. Just don't jump off things until you're five. What? Until I'm five? So I can just. No. What would it matter? No, I mean like. Oh my gosh. People will be better parents. <laughs> are you sure about that? Because you can't harm the baby. Hmm. Like, I worry a lot about dropping a person's kid when they give them to me. Oh, okay. So, I'm like... <laughs> they just bounce? Yeah, they just... They, no, they don't bounce. You just hit the ground and I hear some cracks. I'm like, hey, they'll heal themselves. They'll be fine. They learned today <laughs> not to jump into my oh, arms. Oh, they're fine. They're, <laughs> yeah, fine. they're fine. Simple <laughs> as that. Like, you would be having so much fun just... And then, if I guess the only thing people got to worry about is if people, like, kidnap your kid, maybe. Yeah. But then again, what are they going to do? Cut your kid's finger off? How can they threaten him? <laughs> We're gonna you be cut a terrible parent if you're like, oh, I got your kid. Okay. okay you got to feed him now. <laughs> <laughs> it's your responsibility yeah. now. <laughs> yeah. yeah I didn't want him anyway. He was an accident. Keep oh him. I wanted my baby. <laughs> <laughs> oh, as a boy? Maybe not. Yeah. I want a girl. I want a girl. No, they're complicated. No. I live with girls and I love girls. Wait. I'm dating a girl. <laughs> Girls, girls, girls. <laughs> I like little girls. Girls are so cute and tiny. That just sounded odd, but I get what you meant. <laughs> I like, if you know me, you know. I know what you I mean. I like my little, my, li- my little, my little, little kids, sister. They have to She's be like so little girls. Cal- yes. But yeah. Either way. Yeah. Yes. Oh, but yeah, I think it'll make better parents. But yeah, you want, you'd only need a few doctors, I guess. You need like 10 per state, depending on the state or how Unless much, they how make you go to a specific state to have your baby. Oh, boy. A lot more Abdullahs. There we go. Abdullahs? Isn't that what they're called? Home... Uh, pregnancy women coaches things. I'm sure there are male versions. I think they're called Abdullahs. Abdullahs? Yeah. They birth their baby at home. Usually they have a pool. Did you ever see that movie with Jennifer Lopez where she, I think it was her, and there was a lady and they birthed in a pool inside your house? You need to look up Abdullah. <laughs> I swear it's Abdullah. 
Okay. Anyway, Abdullah. moving on to your second point. Mm, I need to figure out what an Abdullah is. Figure that out after the podcast. No, 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 no. Because then I'll it's forget. It's more to edit. <laughs> A-B-D-U-L-A. Okay. So Abdullah is coming up as a person. I swear it's Abdullah. <laughs> Not Abdullah. I think so. That's a super being. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's Abdullah. It's not Abdullah. A B D U L A. Abdullah. Wikipedia is a proper noun. It's Portuguese proper noun. A male given name equivalent to English Abdullah. Urban Dictionary is one who is a super. Oh, I'm sorry. Being. It's called a doula. Fag. <laughs> it's a doula. <laughs> doula. I'm sorry. I apologize. D O U L A. Yeah, doula training and certification. There you go. It's okay. a doula. Okay. Where'd I get ab from? I don't <laughs> maybe, know. Maybe that doula has abs. <laughs> ab doula. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, your second point. <laughs> okay, so my second point is that extreme, extreme sports. Extreme, extreme sports. Extreme, extreme sports. Why isn't every sport sport just extreme? No, no, no. Extreme, extreme sports. Okay, give me a list of your extreme, extreme sports. Go ahead. Go. Run them down. Let's go. What you got? Um, And what makes it extreme? Okay. And you can't just add fire to everything. Dang it. (laughs) Hockey on fire. (laughs) That was you. you, You're the... No, you know what? Hobby geek, except everything explodes. There you go. (laughs) Okay, but like... Okay, so there's the regular sports for those that are still scaredy cats that are like, I don't, I don't know about that. They're like those, just like there's, there's, there's just people that are naturally like timid and shy and they don't want to do things like that. Understand. So you've got those, the regular sports for them. You've got extreme sports for the people that are like, I mean, I don't want to just do that. What's I want to do a little sports? bit more. Extreme sports is like um, skydiving. And that's not, it's, it's a, already a thing though. Yes, but it's an extreme sport. Skydiving. It's not a sport. Cliff, it's, I don't think I don't think skydiving counts as a sport. You're literally falling. Sky- <laughs> it's not, there, it takes no effort on okay. your part to Sky- fall. <laughs> skydiving, cliff no. diving, base maybe jumping, cliff diving, base jumping. Okay, maybe. bungee jumping. That a little that's bit. very because if you do also, it wrong, I don't it's know. Snap. Also, I don't know. That's not really a sport. It's an activity. Mm. These aren't sports. These aren't extreme I can't, extreme activities. I can't beat you in skydiving. <laughs> oh, I fell faster. Okay. <laughs> Um, what does that do? <laughs> I didn't bungee jump faster than you. What does that do? <laughs> Nothing. Um, no one wins a championship off of skydive. What? <laughs> no, they're not in the Olympics. <laughs> no. <laughs> I think they do have like competitions though. Of like of group, what? I think of group skydivers that go because what they do is they if it's also, like synchronized swimming, okay. Yeah, they do synchronized skydiving. Okay, that's they different. Have like synchronized <laughs> skydiving is different from <laughs> skydiving. Okay, so synchronized skydiving is the extreme sport. Okay, mind you, sports are dull. I don't know what classifies. Sport. You don't know anything in sports? I know. Listen, sports involve. <laughs> I know what a sport two is. Two groups of teams. Uh, going against each other, usually a ball is involved. <laughs> no, and swimming is a sport, and that's multiple teams. I say teams. usually a ball is involved. The biggest sports have balls. Swimming is a big sport. Compare it to basketball, football, soccer, Fine. baseball. Fine. Tennis. Fine. Swimming is way below those. Fine. <laughs> Thank you. You swimmers, I'm sorry to attack you. <laughs> I'm saying you're at the bottom of the totem pole. No, we're, we're, above, we're above a lot of things. Name them. Tennis. No, no, not. no table tennis. I don't know about that. Yeah, you probably are. You probably are. Yep. Because other sports is humongous. Yes. Like, Table tennis is like ex- secluded. Well, so unless you're talking about the Olympics. Exclusive, exclusive. Olympics, they have table tennis and they be going ham. They got diving and they go ham there too. Mm, you know do. what? All these extreme sports, I just realized all these extreme sports that I was trying to name all involve falling. Yeah. Controlled okay, falling. Okay, so extreme sports. Let's think. Okay, basketball. How would you make that extreme? Because you got to make it violent okay. because pain is, I mean, pain is still a thing. But pain is still a thing, generally. but you don't have to worry about like falling like, ah, and like staying there until they're like, yeah, he, he's fouled and things like that. Um, so where's the extreme part? Okay, the extreme part is that everybody's on stilts. You're blindfolded. <laughs> 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 this makes no sense. This makes no freaking sense at all. <laughs> on stilts? They're already giant. I don't, uh, I don't, got people I don't like think people realize web in there. No, I know. I don't think people realize this. <laughs> Football, somewhat, but basketball, people don't realize we're watching giants play with a tight little basketball. <laughs> like, just mentally think about that. And you want to put them on stilts? <laughs> 
Jeez. And blindfolded. <laughs> Jeez. But I would say something like, of course, you got to put explosions because it's about pain and violence and stuff. Okay. Is it, does it have to be about violence? It's about, you said extreme. Okay, then fine. Why don't we do like something like hockey, except for every stick is like a machete. No, you're cutting people in half. Is that okay? And then what does that do to the puck? Like it just flies around? You just slice in half? What is that? Those it's sticks, like you fat hot. Oh, these sticks already break anyway. <laughs> I think baseball, there should be a... Uh, what, with grenades? Uh, that'll be awesome. No, no, oh, no, 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 no not grenades, but it's like hot, not hot, hot potato? Hot potato. It's like hot potato. Hot potato, hot potato. Hot potato, hot potato. The fact that we both hot thought potato, of that. Hot potato, <laughs> potato, 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 potato. Yeah. Spaghetti, spaghetti. Sorry. What? The wiggles. Anyway. Um, oh. Yes. <laughs> potato. Anyway. Uh, <laughs> you should look up the, inter- the history of them. They're very interesting. But anyway. Um, I think I've kind of done so that. So like, uh, like there's a timer on it, right? I feel like this is a game, but not this. Like, you were tossing something back and forth, and it was timed. It was supposed to, like, go off, explode, or shake, or something like that, and that's who it went off hot on. Hot potato. No, no, no. There was an actual game that was yes. made. Uh, not hot potato. It was called something else. Oh. Uh, they licensed it. And I, th- I don't oh. think they called it hot potato. <laughs> 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 but, uh, <laughs> but whatever this was, you would do that with baseball, where the ball, the ball is, like, a timer of like explosions is going to go off. Oh, so it's like that. You know that. It would um, speed up baseball, might have Oh my god, my I really would. I would be goodness. so happy. Same yes. with golf. Same with golf. Oh, that would be so amazing. Oh, everybody has to use the same ball, but you have to hurry up and get it in here. Oh, you can't have everybody use the same ball. That won't work. Golf doesn't work like that. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. Baseball can, yes. Baseball golf, can. No. Okay, fine. Let's ignore golf for a bit. So baseball, okay. That kind of. How would that work for fans? Oh, I guess fans too, because if the ball gets knocked in the outfit, you're like. <laughs> 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 and you blow up, or your arm blows off. No, oh, someone the, can pick up your ball. There's no point in catching the ball anymore. It explodes. No, you. I got it. Take my picture and throw it back. True, 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 true. Whoever's team is the least or exploded. In the air. Anyway, whoever's but, uh, team is the least exploded. That's the only the one end, I can think wins. of. So and uh, then yeah, basketball on stills. That's not a. Uh, that's, it's a thing. I don't see how that makes it extreme. <laughs> it makes it stupid. <laughs> you can't move that fast on stilts. Have you ever seen the basketball where they had trampolines on the floor? What? Yeah, look it up. Uh, there's a basketball league where they used to. I don't know if they have any more. They put trampolines on the floor. In, in that front of, like in, not in the middle, uh, like three or four around the goal, and people would jump on them and fly and dunk. Of course, it was very dangerous because people were landing uh, wrong if you landed wrong. You yeah, if yourself. you land wrong, period, on yeah. any type of jump. You but can, now, uh, there you go. Bring that back. Bam. That will work out really stilts. well. No, still. <laughs> <laughs> Let's move on to my second point. <laughs> Stilts. Yeah, that's my second point. What's your second Stilts. <laughs> Listen, I want to incorporate stilts somewhere. <laughs> Football with stilts. <laughs> Skydiving. <laughs> Skydiving with stilts? Yes. That'd be dead. Oh. Ah, oh, no. I no. guess. I guess. Okay. I like this point. It's one of my favorite points. Mm. School plays will be more interesting. Oh, so the deaths are actually deaths? Yeah, you just stab... Not deaths, but you can stab... No, I mean, like, blood. when it's, like, Shakespeare, where it's like, ah, you have, like, then Yeah, like, no, now I can just actually stab you. <laughs> like, like an Othello. Ow! <laughs> Jeremy, why? It's the part. It's the part. You told me to do this. Oh, we we did this to- in dress rehearsal two weeks ago. Oh, yeah, do you every practice time. getting stabbed? Yeah. Well, for the... No, no, no. <laughs> what you do that is... For- suck. Is because I did drama for a lot a while. Um, what you do is you and y'all stab each other. No, nah. oh my. <laughs> no, but we had to do the kissing thing. So Ooh. who did you kiss? A guy named Shannon. That Shannon. Was no. <laughs> no. I know a Shannon. One of us the same guy. It's not. He was the Pillsbury Doughboy. The real guy. No. <laughs> Shannon. Hi, Shannon. So what's Shannon up to nowadays? Have you re- I don't touch know. Him? Got in touch with him? Remember no, back when we... That was in middle remember school. Remember back when we kissed in middle school? Middle school. From that time oh on, my God. fireworks have exploded in my heart, and I've been searching for you, Shannon. No, he was a kid that kept trying to kiss more than what the scene have called for, and I'm like, you need to stop. Of course. Got I'm those, a seventh grader, and you are those, eight. And I'm like a sixth grader, and you're an eighth grader. Stop it. Oh, he's an eighth grader? Yeah. He was older trying to get with that little chiquita. Mm. It was weird. Nah, anyway. he liked them sexy lips. No, Marcy. Para eso. Marcy Stop. lips. Mm. Oh, my God. Did you have the same voice? Yeah. Oh, that's why. <laughs> he was like, oh, you are definitely older. I have not changed in middle school. You the must have got that's... left back. That's what he thought. He was like, this girl's voice is too deep. <laughs> She's eighth grader. <laughs> no, the only thing that's, that's changed is my hair. 
My hair is Your chest and everything has been the same yes. size? Oh, that's a problem. Yeah, you definitely got shoes <laughs> over. He was like, oh, hello, lady. <laughs> hey. Everything has been... The- Actually, no, I've gained a little weight since... Well, of course, you gain weight from middle school to, like, college, but... I gained nothing. I've been a string bean for my whole life. No, I'm definitely bigger. <laughs> I love that you are definitely bigger. <laughs> you don't know me. <laughs> I saw your high school picture. Oh, yeah, true. Yeah, true. yeah, true. yeah. True, true, true. Yeah. Anyway... So what you do is you say, all right, so then you have this scene, and you act on it's like, and then kiss, and then it's like, blah, 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 and then you keep going, but you don't do the actual kiss. Or in this case, the stabbing. I feel like and you should do the And then for stabbing. dress rehearsal, dress rehearsal, it's two weeks of where you come in, and you're dressed like you would for the character, and you do every single thing, two weeks before the official showing. Good. And that's when you do the, all right, so we're going to stab you now, and this is how the stabbing's going to go. We've practiced it. Jimmy knows how he's going to stab you. What All happens? Right, ready? What are, how does and that go. work for understudies? Um, understudies just practice all the roles. If they're not there, like um, every now and again, I think what they did for us, like when I was an understudy for somebody, is that we practiced on our own and all the understudies for the scenes would practice um, if we had time because a lot of us usually had official parts and then we also understudied. So, wait, you had official parts? Yes. So what happens if you were the understudy <laughs> and your official part? Does oh, your understudy you just, take your official part? No, you just do that. You do both? Yeah. Okay. Here's my thing. I think, because you said sometimes they practice. What if it, you get to an understudy that didn't get a chance to practice, right? So oh. then, <laughs> the rest of forgets about it. They stab. He's like, oh, it's not, probably not going to hurt that much. Ow! <laughs> Ow! 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 Oh, gosh. Imagine Ow. you be. Ow. I can ah. <laughs> This really hurts. <laughs> You being the first, I, that would probably be how you can say ow too. Like that. <laughs> it's like, David, you're the understudy. Okay, cool, cool, cool. You know, it's that, I've, heard, I've broken my leg and it didn't hurt that bad. This is fine. So, ow! 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 This hurts. This smarts. <laughs> this smarts me. This, this I have been smitten. <laughs> yeah, that'd be great. I would love that. <laughs> Anyway, is that your second point? That's, that's my second point. Okay. It'd be very entertaining. I think it'd be more entertaining for the parents because parents are bored at these little school plays. You're not gonna do better than the actual people and the actors. You're not Broadway. You're not Hamilton on ice. Oh my god, uh, on ice. <laughs> I, I knocked it up a notch. Oh, so, I'm like, I know they got some like they put Frozen on ice, which makes Hamilton sense. Hamilton on ice. But Hamilton now you got hip hop on ice. There you go. Hip hop so, on ice. Yep. So I'm just saying. You're not going to reach that, that level. That sounds like Because what does that feel like, a parent going to Hamilton and then they got to go see their kids play? No, you're going to suck. I don't care <laughs> if you are my kid. You're boring. Everyone else is boring. Or it's you like you did a great job at your boring, minuscule part. Exactly. But you did good. Exactly. But anyway, what's your last point? My last point yeah. is yeah. that mm-hmm. certain things. Well, what was it? I didn't write it down because I forgot to. I couldn't figure out how to word it. Congratulations. I couldn't figure out how to word it because it was basically like, what was it? It was that weapons aren't, weapons aren't considered weapons. That's what it was. Weapons aren't weapons. They're basically collector's items. Yes. Kind of. Yeah. I wonder what people still use them. Well, animals. You have animals. Yeah, Yeah. But what would you do to kill people? Poison? poison but then your body's metabolism is high enough so that you'd have an accelerated True. speed rate which is kind of negates that unless you do that um ricin i think ricin is no ricin actually takes like three days so you'd need like but still I heal radiation eventually. you just well, still, shoot still, him with radiation no you still no heal. they'd still heal because wolverine heals off of yeah radiation. wolverine he just like shoots out bullets when he heals so no but when he gets radiate radiated when he gets radiation he like his body has melted away, and in some cases, he's he's just fully formed afterwards. Right. So, mm. no more mass murders. <laughs> Yay! Mass shootings. That's gone. No, that's gone. Yeah, it's kind of sad. If well, not sad, but the guy who bought all the bullets, <laughs> uh, or woman who bought all the bullets, the can be mass murders. The murder person too. who bought all the bullets. Yeah. The first day, let's like, say this all happened instantly, and they find out, and they go out and shoot people. Pow, 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 and people are like, ah, 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 oh. No, they're like, ah, I'm dying. Jimmy, you okay? <laughs> Wait, you got shot first. Yeah. Hold on. He just stood up. I oh, just stood up. Oh, wait, we got Oh, wait, no. I would have thought that he was a demon. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> and then I would have checked myself he out was afterwards. I would have thought, oh, my God. Jimmy's a de- my whole life, Jimmy, you never told me? He's Jimmy, like, why didn't did you tell know? me you was the Lucifer? I didn't even know. <laughs> but, yeah, I would have thought that. But, you um, didn't even know. I 
didn't even know. And I got out. He was like, I was like, oh my gosh, am, am I, I a demon, demon too? Yeah, I would have thought that. Demon. Yeah, but demon. And then when he's like, why hasn't anybody staying down? And yeah, then that shooter just. Brrr, but if it's wait. a person who has mental illness, they would think they're really crazy because. Oh, that would be a up. problem. They'd be like, no! also, I might think that the person who sold me the bullets or who I bought it from. Sold me had blanks. it out for me. No, sold me blanks. And yeah. I go back to the store. I'm like, you sold me blanks or rubber pellets because you yeah. see them. You no see rubber pellets. You can tell those. Are, oh, <laughs> you can tell the difference. You can tell the difference when people get hit with by those. Find a BB then. A BB. A BB. You know what a BB gun is? The little bitty pellets. I know. You know what it is. I'm saying when I'm buying guns, I'm not gonna be like, oh, this is definitely <laughs> a bullet. <laughs> Oh no, it's not a bullet. I gotta be the dumbest person who had never seen a gun. And if somebody if somebody is out there selling BB pellets as bullets, oh yeah, definitely this is a bullet. Yeah, this, this is great. The little like, plastic things, yeah. The, but this looks like like one of those old like, bullets from like no, 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 the, this look- the Civil War. Oh no, these are new age bullets. No, 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 that's why they're plastic. But no, like I had someone compare them. Like they said, they're like, you know those like things that they put the pens on? Why are they selling these like to put in a gun? Doesn't that just all come out in one? And I was like, oh God. Wait, the things that they put You the know, pens like on. those, like at the bank when you're writing with the pens and like there's that chain on it? Yeah. Yeah. They thought it was that. So they're like, so there's this container of BBs and they're like, why are they selling these long spools of chain <laughs> when you shoot it? Isn't it all going to come out? Like, you just wasted all your money. Isn't that a real person? Yes! Oh. I was like... It sounds so... See, I was, I was like, I was oh, finding no. it hard to comprehend what you were saying because it sounded so stupid. <laughs> so that's the struggle. Wow. Yes. That's depressing. But she was of people trying to person. kill people, <laughs> my last point, mm-hmm. no more traditional wars... All wars will be won via games. So we're doing Ready Player One on us? No, 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 no. Either a nice rounding game of checkers. Uh, oh. Or maybe some uh, <gasps> chess. <laughs> or maybe some... It depends on the, on the game. If we all don't want to travel, we want to save money, we'll all do online. Maybe some, you know, which... Ah, oh, Japan would win everything. Japan would win like, everything. If we were doing like Call of Duty. So Not we know only we, won't, Japan, we can't do that. Asia. We would do something where we're board games. So all of us will meet at the war zone, okay? Everyone pulls out their, their checkers or their chess board. Checkers, chess, cards. Yeah, cards. And Candy we all land, play, shoots and ladders. We all play in the best. <laughs> no Monopoly. <laughs> no Monopoly. No Monopoly. That'll take too long. But anyway, we all, we all play board games and the winners of those board games, you add up the tallies of what country they come from. That's who wins the war. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> Simple as that. Unless you have those people that are like, no, poof. And just I mean, like you could still shoot board. bombs. But the thing is, you're just. You would ruin the world. You yeah, you ruin the world. The you wouldn't ruin the people. So and they'd that's be the like, point. man, come on. My house, come on. man. So yeah, that's. that's Actually, that would be a more effective war. Because you you're not killing people, you're killing their land. So You don't want to kill their land. You wanna, you're killing people in order to make a point. Right. And you kill people in order so less people come and attack you. But now they're hindered because you just blew up. Now I'm more things. pissed because you blew up my house, <laughs> and I have no, I have no, I have nothing to do. Now I'm going to come to war. I'm like, oh no, he did it. Time to go stab him in the face a couple of times. <laughs> stab, 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 stab. He's stab, not going to die. Stab, stab. What I'm going to do is say, oh man. So all I can do is go blow up your house. I can't do anything else. I can't kill you and get you back. Stab, 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 yeah, stab, like, stab, stab. I can't stab. do any of that. So. <laughs> But anyway, uh, those are three points. Let's run down them real quick. All right, so my three points real quick, real quick. are no more doctors, extreme, extreme sports, and collectible weapons. You didn't give Your us three extreme points. sports. Shh. Um, it's, everything's on stilts. <laughs> <laughs> you got to swim with stilts. That would be so stupid. <laughs> How do you swim with stilts? You would be at the other you end. You know when you <laughs> curl down oh. and you turn around? I assume <laughs> when you curl, your stilts would just smack <laughs> the top and snap off. <laughs> So you got to no, that would be the worst belly flop ever. And uh, no, no, I just meant like when you're racing in the water and then you have to curl oh, under, flip. yeah, the flip, and you, you're still probably come out and just smack and snap it out. It's like, and he's coming down and they're trying to catch him and he does the curl and oh, psh, oh, there it goes. There it goes his steps. He's got the right one still on. Let's go, let's go, let's, let's go. go. He can make it. Be horrible. Anyway, um, huh, ping pong on stilts. Okay. Uh, <laughs> My three points were that hospitals would shut down, schools, uh, would, school plays would be more entertaining, and no more wars, traditional wars. And that's the show. Marcy, where can they find you? 
You can find me on Instagram at Marcy underscore one one dot nine. And nice. hey, I got a Twitter. Oh, you do? You follow me? Yes. I was very surprised. I saw that. Yes. Because <laughs> I followed you and then like it was like one and then like it took the other one. Like it was like, wait a minute. It, yeah, 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 this is her click. Like, no, it came later. I was like, what is this? Uh, I was uh, in a somewhat no signals on this past weekend. So uh, okay. at different points. Anyway, my Twitter is Marcy underscore one one nine. Because they won't let you put a stupid period on Twitter. They won't? No, in your username, it's only underscores. I can do Marcy underscore one one underscore nine. But I'm like, that's too many underscores. So Marcy underscore one one nine. So are you going to change your Instagram to be that? No. Okay, cool. Uh, I what are you? on Instagram at Pinterest underscore poems. Go listen and to Go follow him. He does some great things. Thanks. And I'm also on uh, Twitter, Twitter at Clark Kent type. <laughs> Shout out to the stars. The star. uh, if you see this movie, let us know what you think. Tell us about it. Did it meet your expectations? And hey, if you don't see this movie, just go see a movie. Let us know what it was. Recommend us something to watch. If you don't care about this movie, tell me why. That too. Yeah. Reach out to us. We don't bite. And hey, if you're on I iTunes, do. no, he doesn't. He gets bitten. I nibble. He does not bite. Nibble, 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 nibble. If you're a cookie, you're getting eaten. Nibble, 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 nibble. Anyway, <laughs> um, and if you're listening to us on iTunes, please go ahead, rate us, review us, go ahead. And if you don't want to do that, just go ahead and tell a friend. Tell a friend. Tell a friend. And Marilyn, you're still doing great. You are doing great, Marilyn. We love Georgia, you. pick it up. Come on. Pick it up. <laughs> we <Georgia>. live here. <laughs> Come on, man. We live here. <laughs> we live here, man. Anyway, uh, have a great day, guys. And ta-ta. Ta-ta for now. <laughs>